Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is going to be another in my series of best of drugstore makeup where I basically take a makeup brand from the drugstore and kind of share with you guys, take you on a little journey of my absolute top must have favorite products from that brand. I've done this before on my channel with Maybelline, NYX, L'Oreal a lot of drugstore brands, so I thought I'd do one today on a brand I haven't really kind of hit on, and that is Flower Beauty, which you can find on the flowerbeauty.com website, of course, or Walmart. It's an affordable brand that I would say ranges from anywhere from $6 to about $14 per product. Amazing, amazing items. I'm really, really impressed with the quality, the pigmentation, so let's just get into this video. So I guess I'll start off with the lip products. I have two different categories. I have gloss and then I have a more kind of lipstick type cream product. So for gloss, I have these guys right here. These are called High Shine Lip Blackers and these are the two shades I have and love both of them for two different reasons. One is more for dressing up at night and I think the other one's perfect for summer. So this one is called Give Peach a Chance and it's a beautiful glossy peach. It's so gorgeous for spring and summer. I was wearing this in a past video on my channel and I didn't even need to pair it with a lip liner underneath. That's how opaque these are that's why I really like them because I feel like you get that full color intense payoff but they aren't sticky they aren't slidey or slippy I feel like they remain on your lips pretty long they're basically a long wearing gloss that isn't sticky so they're perfection in my book and I really love give peach a chance for like everyday spring summer and then if you want to dress up at night or in the fall winter you want a vampier kind of nude this is a beautiful soft rose it's actually called autumn rose which is perfect because it is like the perfect autumn fall rosy nude shade which I adore and the second category of lips goes to the Hydra Silk Ultimate Lip Butters. These are creamy, glossy kind of lipsticks. They're very hydrating and they're in that kind of chubby pencil stick form. I love them because you don't need a mirror. They're the kind of lip product you can have in your bag and just kind of pull it out and apply as needed or necessary. They're a really nice, hydrating, comfortably wearing lip color. I'm wearing one of them today, the darker of the two. It's called Rose Petal. It's a beautiful kind of dark rose. It's the color I'm wearing today. It's like a darker mauve. And then the other shade is the nudist of the bunch and I had to pick it up because I love nude lip colors for every day and just, I don't know, I just have an affinity for nude lip colors. This one is actually called Naked Petal. And as you can see in the difference, how this one's a lot lighter than the one I'm wearing today, but they're both beautiful. They're both comfortably wearing. They're very, very creamy and buttery on the lips, but they're not slippery and I feel like they do last pretty long. I feel like these are the ultimate combination of a lip balm and a lipstick. They're really, really awesome because they give you that kind of skincare ingredient of feeling hydrating and moisturizing on the lip, but then they give you the color payoff of a lipstick. So I really love the Hydra Silk Ultimate Lip Butters from Flower Beauty. I believe there's two, three, maybe four more shades. These are the two I picked up. These are the two I'm loving the most, but I may go back and check out the other shades to see if I'm missing something that I may need to add to my collection. And before we continue, I did want to make a quick mention the packaging. This is such adorable packaging. I love how the name Flower is kind of emblazoned on the packaging itself in a rose gold. It's so pretty and so cute. I was drawn to the packaging the most with this brand. I love it. So next, let's talk about the blushes. I was impressed, blown away completely by their blushes. I have three shades and they are all fantastically gorgeous. These are their Flower Pots powder blushes and they're phenomenal. Very smooth in application. They're pigmented. They're so easy to blend and they have staying power, which is impressive. So I have three of them and this first shade is called Peach Primrose. It's a beautiful, soft nectarine peach, perfect for summer, especially if you're doing a softer eye look or you want to match your blush to maybe a peachy or light pink eye look. I think that this shade in Peach Primrose would be a nice little kind of addition to your makeup. The second shade is the one I'm wearing today. This one is called Warm Hibiscus and it's not matte. The first one was matte. This has a bit of a satin finish, kind of glowy sheen to it. It's almost like a highlighter and blush in one. It's the blush I have on today. I like it because it's a mixture of peach and pink with a touch of rose gold to it with the little kind of shimmer and sheen that's laced throughout the product itself. I love the little rose detail of these blushes. It's just... I'm just in love with these. I'm obsessed. And then the last shade is called Sweet Pea and it's a pretty kind of cool tone pink. I don't tend to reach for these pinks as blushes because they scare me when I first look at them on the pan. But every single time I think that and then I go to apply it, pop it onto my cheeks, I'm always, always impressed because sometimes it's deceiving what you see in the pan because it has to mix with your skin tone and you're like pH and you're going to see a difference on the skin and I'm always blown away. One of the blushes that scared me like that is this one over here from Wet n Wild. It's called Fantastic Plastic Pink and it's 
it's a super bright like plastic Barbie pink. It freaked me out at first and I remember grabbing it just because I didn't have it in my collection yet. And I actually love this. I absolutely love this in the summer, especially paired with nails like this or a hot acid neon t-shirt like this. These blushes pack a punch and they blend nicely into the skin and they give you that kind of natural unblushing romantic just flush to your cheeks. And that's what this one from Flower Beauty does for me, the one in Sweet Pea. And I love the name. It's adorable. And now I guess we will move into the last two products. So the first one is the Shimmer and Shade Eyeshadow Palette. This one is in Golden Natural. It's the only palette I picked up because of the color scheme. It just called my name. I love bronzes. I love metallics and golds and shimmers. And this has the perfect mixture of that. You basically have one or two mattes in here, which are great for transitioning, for blending, for starting your eye look. And then the rest of them are shimmery or metallic, frosted satin, just amazing, yummy, delicious shades and I love the highlighting shades up here. A white gold and then you have an actual true yellow gold right here. They're so beautiful. You could even highlight your face with them. Though I didn't today, but I did highlight my eyes and the inner corner with these shades. They are just incredible. Creamy, easy to blend. And actually the brush that this palette comes with isn't bad. It's actually pretty good. It's a little small blending brush. I love the packaging. And I was able to achieve this eye look by blending with that. And then the last palette is my absolute probably favorite product of all from Flower Beauty. This is the Shimmer and Strobe Highlighting Palette in the one called SP Number no. 1. It's a three pan highlighting palette. It has again a kind of champagne white gold. It has a pinky highlight and then a beautiful yellow true gold here. It comes with a really cute fan kind of shaped brush which actually does apply the highlight really nicely. It is intense if you guys are looking for intense in your face. Beautiful spotlighting highlight. Check out this palette from Flower Beauty. You will not be disappointed. I love it. I love it so much. In fact, I'm wearing these two shades today, outer shades. I started with the lighter white gold one, and then I popped on this yellower gold just right in the center. But that's all I use today to highlight my cheeks, down the bridge of my nose, just, you know, all the places where light would naturally hit. So that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I thought it would be fun to kind of resurrect my best of beauty. If you guys wanna see more videos like this, any other drugstore brands, maybe Essence. I love a lot of products from Essence and they're super affordable. You can find them online, of course, and at Ulta. Maybe I can do that one in the future or if you think of any other brands I haven't done yet on my channel, please let me know. I would love to sit down and play with some products and then get back to you guys with a video surrounding that brand. So definitely let me know in the comment box below. Please request anything else you'd like to see. I have a couple ideas for my next few videos that I'd like to film film. Some are inspired by your requests and some are just things I thought of on my own. Thanks for watching guys. I love it when you guys tune in and spend this time with me and I will catch you guys in the next upload. Take care and have a beautiful week and I will see you guys next week. Bye guys. So my favorite shimmer, so my favorite shimmer. So the first one is the, hopefully what I said the first time worked because I'm going to cut it there. Okay.